This is CRTA Channel 5, Toronto. Tonight. Now to you, Ron. What's up? They best not be singing Let It Snow, Let It Snow, Let It Snow out in the east tonight. Cape Breton, residents have to stay home and give the plows a chance. Roads were blocked throughout the region for the third time this month. Businesses and residents are throwing snow over their heads, adding to this ever-growing drifts. The severe... <laughs> The severe weather will be reaching consequences. Experts say that businesses will see a downturn. At least the, snow, the storm was expected. Radars have been showing a storm gathering in, in the eastern United States before it slipped up and, and, hit, and hit fun to the kids and aching arms and backs to the parents. Brought. The weather may be frightful in Germany and all, and all lights and all eyes are on a cuddly baby polar bear. These are brand new pictures of the four-week-old little creature. He was taken from his mother because she appeared to be abusive. The keepers were afraid that the mother might kill this little guy. Zookeepers are feeding the baby high-fat food every two to three hours, and they hope to give the cub a public debut at the German Zoo by the end of April. It's not an easy thing to separate a baby from its mother and the wild where he belongs. But so far, so good. Back to you, Ron. Police have arrested 28 people in connection with the telemarketing scam. They worked in Montreal, but the victims were Eastern United States. It's sad. Police say they built more than 100,000 elderly citizens out of $45 million. The seniors were offered low interest loans and credit cards in return for a $250 sign up fee. The services they paid for did not exist. The automotive industry is at a crossroads. It knows it needs to make more environmentally friendly and fuel efficient cars before it continues to pump its F-150 pickup truck. 31 years running and the number one vehicle uh, of all in the marketplace for the last 26 years. Dodge is hoping consumers will stampede into showrooms to check out its new lineup. The company staged an old-fashioned cattle drive through the streets of Detroit to unveil its new Dodge Ram pickup truck. That's it today for the news, and now the weather. Standing by is that quintessential pro DJ, um, Alex. What's up, y'all? Eyes like Tupac all over Canada. Uh, we got to check out the weather. Over here, it's raining, so stay inside. Over here, it's thunder, so stay inside. <laughs> Over here, it's cloudy, so stay inside. And in Toronto, oh, I'm up the CN Tower. Uh, in Toronto, we have a high of minus 12, a low of minus 17. Get low. Uh, currently, it's 17, and, tomorrow, and it feels like minus 27, so stay home. Thanks, Ron. Please join us tonight at 11 o'clock for Night Final Report. We're back tomorrow with the CRTA Morning News. Goodbye for now.